It's a sneaky little thing that comes without a call. When you think you have it conquered is when you lose it all. It starts with a shot, then onto a pint. Then before you know it, you're lost in the night. A woman passes by and asks if you're okay. You swing for her in anger like your ex who didn't obey. You look down and realise that you've got it all wrong. Hallucination and perception need not have been so strong. You carry on walking past a young couple fighting. Some guy groped some girl. Sexual assault he was inciting. You get to your car and put keys in the ignition. The road is hard to navigate. How did you get in this position? On the pavement to your left, a father and a son. Criminal activity as he reduces the boy to none. Child molestation is a crime like no other. You are thrown back in time when you lived without a mother. Your eyes are transfixed now on the boy and his pain. Forgetting led you down this road, yet the trauma still remains. The journey is long, or so it may seem. Towards you a bright light from a car at full steam. Time has slowed down now. You face your consequence. You wonder, was it worth it, as you hurtle through a fence. This nightmare of horror, ignited from each alcoholic drop, as you pass away slowly. If only you'd stopped. Introducing Rethink Your Drink. This integrated campaign would come to life through above-the-line prints. In a similar way, road signs would be altered to narrate, educate, and quantify just how dangerous skewed perceptions can be. A gorilla installation, consisting of a stationary crashed car with human-sized alcohol bottles sitting in the seats, would be placed outside clubs and pubs to remind those who are intoxicated to rethink their drink through the shock factor instilled. Within the club itself, UV reactant hand stamps would be deployed to remind those to be cautious when consuming alcohol but no image would materialise. Only once they enter the club will the UV lights inside cause the hand stamp to glow, challenging perceptions once again. A supermarket takeover would be performed by replacing standard alcohol bottles with reworked labels. It is only once you look again will you realise the differing aesthetic, causing your perceptions of alcohol to change as you learn the detrimental effects the product can have. AR would allow the bottles to come to life by scanning the original label with the camera on your smartphone. It would reveal the reworked, more sinister design, allowing you to swipe up to the DrinkAware website where you can access educational resources and helplines, encouraging you once again to rethink your drink.